South Korea's President Yoon Suk Yeol said Thursday that his government could review the possibility of sending lethal weapons to Ukraine, depending on North Korean troops' activities, in Russia. The statement came during the joint press conference with Poland's President Andrzej Duda, who agreed to bolster their joint response to North Korea's troop dispatch to Russia during Thursday's summit. South Korea, as principal, has not supplied lethal weapons to Ukraine. The meeting between Yoon and Duda came a day after U.S. and South Korean officials said they believe around 3,000 North Korean troops have been deployed to Russia and are training at several locations. South Korea's spy agency told lawmakers that North Korea likely aims to send a total of 10,000 troops to Russia by the end of the year. Both Moscow and Pyongyang have denied the presence of North Korean troops. Uh,我们的台湾区域的时候，事实上，武器的直接供给不足，使得，呃，各方部门에서도，더유연하게，呃，북한군의활동여하에따라，呃，검토해나갈수있습니다。呃，我们的台湾区域的时候，事实上，
Here in Estonia, you know how close some of those challenges can be. Um, I asked the president and, and he said I will absolutely do that uh, to send experts from the Republic of Korea uh, to brief the North uh, Atlantic Council. That will now happen early next week. Um, and then we will see whether North Korea is indeed or not uh, supporting um, Russia's illegal uh, war in Ukraine. If that would be the case, if they would be sending troops uh, to Ukraine, that would mark a significant escalation. That would really be uh, uh, important, a significant escalation. So at this moment, uh, I cannot confirm it uh, other than that we will get the latest update from South Korea early next week. Thank you very much. Thank you.